Hey guys, what's going on? Good part tutorials here, and welcome to another tutorial. So in this tutorial, we're covering the RPG Game Maker, uh, specifically RPG Maker VX Ace, and we'll just be creating a simple game in it, and just so you get a basic understanding of what this software actually is. All right, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to create a new project. So we can go to File, New Project. Now I'm going to place call this tutorial. Give the game title tutorial. Press OK. Alright, so we're giving this default screen. Um, what we're going to do first is we're going to clear out all the assets so that we can create our own custom stuff. So to do that, we go to Tools, Database, and you'll see here that we have a whole heap of tabs. So there we go. And these are the basic assets of your game. So we're going to start off with the Actors tab. Now this is pretty self-explanatory. This is the characters within our game. Number one will generally be your playable character, the one that you control. Uh, but you can change that. So we're just going to delete all these. So just simply go to the top or bottom. Oh wait, first we're going to change maximum. Set it to one. And press delete. Uh, can I do that? There we go. Now we'll change maximum again, we'll make this about 5. There we go. So next we have classes. We're going to change the maximum to 1 again. Click on soldier. And we'll change the maximum to 4. Skills, let's do this. Uh, we'll keep the skills actually. The items, we want to delete all these, so change the maximum to 1. Delete the poison. poison sorry. Right there is poison. We'll change this to about 20. Weapons, uh, we'll delete all these, so let's go ahead and change maximum to 1. We'll change the maximum uh, to 10 and delete the hand axe. Um, let's just do the same again, so change the maximum to 1. Delete. We'll change maximum, we'll set this to about 20. Enemies, we'll keep the enemies, I think. Yeah, we'll keep the enemies, just because. The troops, we will delete these, so let's change the maximum to 1. Uh, we'll delete the first one. And change the maximum to about 20. States, we will keep these, we'll keep the animations, tile sets, common events. Alright, and now let's get into the system part. So the initial party is the starting or the start group pretty much. So that's how much characters you have uh, that follow your main character. These will be in the battle as well, but we'll get into that. We'll get into more detail later. Now, basically, this is the basic setup of your game. Uh, this is the music setup. Sorry, we have the starting position over here. We have the boat starting position, ship starting position, airship starting position, and we have the title screen graphics. So let's go ahead and change that. That's just down in the bottom right hand corner. Now we'll change this to a book. Uh, book sounds good. We'll keep that in none. And we'll draw a game title. We'll set that to on. And we'll change the title screen music. So over on the left side. We'll go ahead. Oh, that's way loud. Uh, let's check. So we'll keep that town on. The window color, this is going to be the background for your chat. So I'm going to change this to a nice red. So that's full red. Oh, green, all that. Might add a bit more blue. No, maybe a bit more green. Hmm. Yeah, that's good. We'll drop the red value a bit more. Press OK, and let's get on to the Terms tab. Alright, so we have these basic um, elements here, so we're going to change the maximum to 1. We'll delete that. Alright, never mind. Alright, we'll just change the name of that. So what we're going to have is we're going to have Physical, Magical, Fire, Earth, Wind and Water. So let's go ahead and change the maximum to... Alright, so we got 
magical, physical, fire, earth, water, uh, air. So that's six. So we'll change that to six. There we go. Magical. Even before I've counted wrong. Fire. Oh, that's good. Alright, so there are basic attack elements that are. So basically, this is the type of damage that will be dealt. Uh, we're going to change the weapon types now. So we're going to set this to 1. We're going to change the first one. We'll make this a dagger. So we'll do the... Um, what do you call it? Physical weapons first. We'll change this max to 15. Uh, we'll do a sword. We'll do a battle axe. And we'll do a spear. Alright, so we'll do the magical items now. So let's do a wand, a staff, and we'll do a book. Uh, for the archer, we're going to do an archer, so we'll have bow. Uh, what else can we have? Crossbow. And for the rogue, because well, we're going to have a warrior, magician, rogue, and archer. So for the rogue, we can just use dagger, but we will add hidden blade as well. So this is going to be like an assassin type thing. We'll change the maximum to 10 though. Uh, skill types, so we're going to set this to physical and magical. Uh, armor types, we will change this to 1. We'll have armor, this is going to protect us against physical damage. Uh, we will have, we'll set it to about 5, uh, we're going to have Enchanted Armor, this is going to protect us against magic. We will have Robes, this will be the basic magician thing that's going to give us magic boost. We will have Light Armor, and this is going to be our basic uh, rogue outfit. And we'll have leather. I suppose that could come under light armor, so we'll change that to four. Alright, there we go. Now we got our basic statuses here. So we're going to go with. So these are the names for our things. So for our level, we have level. Shortcut, I'm going to change it to LVL. HP. Uh, we'll change it to hit points. For the longer point. I don't know what TP is. Does it give it an explanation? No. <laughs> Alright, so we got max HP. Good, 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 good. Equip types. Um, so that seems good to me. Commands we have fire, blah, blah, blah. Item, skill, equip, uh, status, save, game end. We'll change this to exit game. I believe that's the exit thing. New game. Maybe. We'll just go game end. Not exit game. And okay. So we're good to go now. Now what we're going to do for uh, in the next tutorial is we're going to create a basic title screen. So I'll see you guys then, and don't forget to like and subscribe if this helped you in any way. See you guys later.